Hey what's going on guys, it's you and me for the win here, and today we are going to be doing uh, episode, I don't know, something after 12 on uh, Minecraft Modding 1.12.2 tutorial for Java Edition, and today we are going to be doing Orgen, which is pretty simple, if I'm honest, um, so what you want to do, well, no, not simple, but it's okay, uh, in your main package, you want to do new package, and do dot world dot gen dot ors. Uh, no, we don't need the dot. Ors. We'll just do world dot gen. And inside this, we're going to get a new class and call it. Uh, let's call it world gen. Ors. World gen. World gen. World gen cut. No. Can we just do world gen ors? Yeah, let's do just world gen ors. And in interfaces right here, click add and search i world. Oh, i world generator. Click OK. And you see that's there. There you go. Right. So what's it created? Let's see. Okay, that looks fine. We'll just fix it out a bit. Get rid of this. Don't want no to do. Right, so random random int chunk x int chunk z world world i chunk generator chunk generator i chunk provider chunk provider okay in here we need to put if wor uh, world dot provider dot get dimension is equal to zero then generate Generate overworld. This is a, a function we're going to make. Random. Oh, chunk x. Chunk z. World. Chunk. Generate gen uh, a tour and chunk provider and do that. Now we're going to create this method. So we're going to do private void generate overworld. And here we're going to put a uh, random, random int chunk x, int chunk z, world, world, i chunk generator, chunk. Generator and I chunk provider chunk provider and open this up and let's fix any errors. In here we're going to generate or and we're going to do block in it. So I'm just going to generate one of my ores that I already have. But you can generate, uh, you can create a new block and uh, call it whatever you want, like ruby ore, copper ore, whatever. Uh, but I'm just going to generate um, silver blocks. Uh, no, we'll generate random block. Dot get default state. 
world. Random. Chunk x times 16. Chunk z. Oh, chunk z. Capital Z times 16. I'm failing miserably right now, and it's really sad. Right, and then after that, it's basically a bit of customization. So, the first number here is the Y level you want them to be the lowest at. So, I'm going to put mine as 0. So, I want mine to be able to spawn actually, no, Y. Let's think, Y3, I think, is the first level that I want mine to be at. So that's the lowest it can be. And the highest is the second number. So I want mine to be um I want mine to be a hundred. Just so it's just easier for me to find in this tutorial. Um but obviously yeah. And then random.next int, this is basically the size of the vein. So I'm gonna have minus five and then you can do plus two or plus seven. Uh, I'm going to do plus 9 and then let's see what's the last one because I'm not sure if I'm honest hello are you going to it's very slow my eclipse by the way guys uh, what's, what's the last int though Uh, let's see, int chances, okay, it's the chances, so let's have ours, just just for the example of this, just because it's a tutorial, I'm going to put mine as 88, so it's quite high, and obviously if you want to do more, oh, let's just put a semicolon on the end, and let's fix that, right, if you want to do more, you literally just copy, paste, and you change this, change, uh, these don't change these don't change any of these because these are very important these ones after that you can change anything um obviously I'm not gonna do that I only want one right now let's create this generate or method now this is a pretty big method so this is gonna take most of the time but uh, it's another private void void generate or and here we're going to put i block state no it's not sati state or world world um random random int x int z int min y int max y int size int chances and then open these up in here we're going to put int Delta Y is equal to max I max Y minus min Y for int I equals zero I is less than chances I plus plus and inside this for loop we're going to put block pos pos is equal to new block pos x plus random random dot next int I believe next well done wrong random dot next pretty sure it's random dot next in 
uh, in that we need to put 16 and then min y plus random dot next int delta y z plus random dot next int 16 no, not 18, 16. I think that's all the math, except that's all. And we need to import iBlock state. Uh, why is it being very slow? I don't like this. Alright, well, let's finish the rest of this for loop then. And then we'll do world gen mineable. Is that how you spell mineable? No, there's no E. Mineable generator equals new world gen mineable. This is the easy part, of course. Or size. And I believe that's it for that one. And then I believe there's one last thing in this part. So generator dot generate and it is world uh, random and pause and we'll put a semicolon on the end I think that's it Oh, I didn't put a comma there, that's why it's giving loads of errors. Okay. And fix this, come on. Everything should fix itself. Just import block pause. This is very, very slow. Alright, save. Yay! <laughs> oh, that took so long. Need to register it. That's the last thing we need to do now. So go into your main class, and we're going to be adding something to pre in it this time. So we're going to do game registry dot register world generator. So I just got in the game and I just realised we're going to need a new world for this. <coughs> so, test, ors, creative, create new world. 
Um, yeah, so we need to let the world create here. Alright, guys. <clears throat> the game just crashed. And we're about to debug it to see why. Um, so, if I go into world.gen, world.gen ores. Okay, so basically, it's trying to place my ores <coughs> in place of other blocks. Uh, so they're basically colliding. Can we get a... Uh, let's see, if I scroll up... Let's see if I can get a reason for that. No. Um. <clears throat> okay, maybe 88 is too high. So I'll try like 44. Alright. No, I'll do like 30. Let's see if that fixes anything. It might have just be me being stupid, but I'll see you in the game. Guys, I'm back. Uh, it's finally done. It took a long time, to say the least. Um, I don't know why. I don't know if it'll take you this long. Um, but yeah, it's took me a while. I don't know why. So let's dig down, see if we can find. Yep, there it is. <laughs> so that's one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, lag, lag, lag. It crashed. Okay, I think 30 is a bit high, so maybe like 20. <clears throat> um, I'm sure you can mess around with that and get it to work. But, uh, yeah. Um,. Let's see what I have it on on my, my personal mod. I have some on 45, so I don't know why it would be wrong. Okay, what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm just going to check something here. Okay, so guys, uh, I seem to, I must have done something wrong somewhere, because this one didn't take very long to load, and if we mine down, hopefully, we should, um, first let me increase this to like 20 chunks, max frame rate unlimited, uh, brightness bright. Let's see if we can find it. Yep, there you go. There's our tin block. And there's some more there, which I just broke. Uh, yep, some right there. Some there. Uh, if you guys did enjoy this video and want to see more, then smash your face and hit the like button and subscribe. Uh, if you really enjoy the video, please do be sure to share it. And um, yeah. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Uh, so, uh, yeah. Bye, guys.